this might be a good little project. Show you how to make some interlocking letters. Might look good on a logo or business card or something. We'll show you how to do this. First, we'll of course start with some text, just A, B, C. see what we're doing. Now this is going to have to be separated. And the way you can do this is go to path, object to path, go back to path, break apart, and then you can ungroup it. Press your ungroup button here. You can use shift control G either one. separate it. Alright, let's change the color on it. <coughs> yeah, I'll make this in red for the fun of it, and that one in blue, and oh, let's see. That ought to do. Now, I'm going to zoom in just a little bit. See a little better. I'm going to take this one and Put right or make sure it's behind the V. Eh, something about like so. I'm going to have to zoom out a little bit to have some room. Now, we want to duplicate this, and you can use the duplicate button here, or you can right click. Hold down your control key. This is important because that'll you can drag it off in a straight line. Now we'll go to our Bezier tool, and you can see right in here this is the part we want of that leg. So we can start right along here. And just get the whole thing there. Hold down your shift key and select the A. And go back to your path menu and select intersection. Now, hold down your control key again and drag it right straight back across until it lines up. Yeah, that looks good right there. Now we can do the same thing with the C. We're going to put this, put it behind. Mm, let's see here. And that looks pretty good. I'm just for the fun of it going to drag a guide down so we'll know where to cut. Okay, we'll duplicate this. Hold down your control key. Drag it over. All right, we got our Bezier tool. And we can start right here. And we'll just cut the whole thing off if we want to. Right there. Select that, shift key. Section. Drag down your control, hold down your control, and drag that back over right there. Just a little bit of adjustment. I think that looks good. Now we can group them. And there you are. That does need a little more adjustment there, about one, but I'm running out of time here. <laughs> so we'll get that later. See you again.